Hello viewers, this is Prio and welcome to Shine Electronics. I am back with a completely new project today about how to control the speed of a single DC geared motor with Arduino Uno and L2988 motor driver field which is just a basic part to control a robo car or drone. So before starting, if you are a new viewer, watch the video till the end and don't forget to comment below about your new robot. So let's get started. For this project, we should need a Arduino Uno, a L298N motor driver shield, two gear motors, two wheels, two 3.7 volt 18650 lithium ion battery, 1200 mAh power, a USB cable, some jumper wires male to male, and male to female and some connecting wires solder the positive and negative wires of the motors before coming to the connections let's at first look onto this L2980N module uh, it has a L298 and chip attached to it with a heat sink here it has two outputs for attaching the motors out 3 and out 2 okay here is the power supply section where this is the 12 volt this is the ground and this is the 5 volt here is the section from where you can control the speed of the motors here is the enable a here is the jumper in this part if you remove the jumper then a pin will be visible to you if we remove the jumper from here then you can see that there are two pins we will use this pin as the enable a pin and these are the in one in two in three in four and this is the enable b if you want to control the speed of the out three that is the motor attached to the output three then we should uh, remove this jumper as we have removed this jumper so we can control the speed of the motor attached to this output okay and here is the 5 volt regulator here which converts the 12 volts to 5 volts from here this 5 volt we can power up our arduino uh, in any robots if you use the l2980 module so this is the whole l2980 module description now let's come to the arduino part you can see that in the Arduino there are 5, 6 and 9, 10, 11 these pins are the PWM pins you can see the PWM sign there ok so we will use the pin number 5 to control the speed of the motors also we can use the pin number 9, 6 etc ok so now let's connect the L2980 module with the Arduino Connect the enable A pin to the pin number 5 of the Arduino. In one pin to the pin number 6 of the Arduino. And in two pin. to the pin number 7 of the Arduino as we have connected the enable A pin to the Arduino so the speed of the motor connected to the output 2 or to the left uh, of the L2980 module will be controlled after attaching the motor attach the wheel to it after that we will use this uh, 7.4 volt supply uh, which is connected in series to this L2980 module before that we need to connect the L2980 module to the Arduino to power up the 
Arduino also with this battery okay so we will use two male to male jumpers to connect to the Arduino we should connect the 5 volt to the 5 volt of the Arduino and we should connect the ground from here to the ground of the Arduino which is here now before attaching the battery let's program your Arduino the code is very much simple here we will not need any library to control the speed of the DC geared motor Simply we have to declare the pins uh, to which we have connected the motor driver shield. We have connected the enable A pin to the pin number 5 of the Arduino which is the PWM pin, the in 1 pin of the shield to the pin number 6 and the in 2 to the pin number 7 of the Arduino. In the void setup part, we should declare all the pins as the output. Now if you want to rotate to in the clockwise uh, direction, then we have to send a high signal to the in 1 pin of the motor driver shield and a low signal to the in2 pin of the motor driver shield and since we are using the enable a pin as the pwm so we should send a pwm signal to the enable a pin of the motor driver shield and we should enter any value here from 0 to 255 here i have entered 255 so that the motor will rotate in full speed so here after rotating uh, in clockwise direction for two seconds delay 2000 means uh, up to 2 seconds it will rotate and after 2 seconds it will stop ok and here the both the in1 and in2 are declared low so that the motor will stop for 2 seconds after that it will rotate in counterclockwise direction here the in1 is low and the in2 is high unlike here where in1 is high and in2 is low just the opposite part is here while uh, making the motor rotation direction opposite and here also the enable signal is 255 so that the motor rotate in full speed and after 2 seconds again it will stop ok after that the in1 is high and in2 is low and the enable a is given 127 that is the motor will rotate in half speed in clockwise direction after 2 seconds it will again stop and after a delay of 2 seconds it will rotate counter clockwise at a half speed which is 127 okay and at last it will stop here if you want to repeat the code then we have you have to just copy this section from clockwise to here stop and just paste it below okay so that the motor rotation continues after that okay so the code is very simple just upload the code to your arduino and we will be all done okay so let's see the rotation after programming is complete, remove the USB cable and connect the battery. Connect the ground to the ground of the L2918 and the positive to the 12 volt of the L2918. You can see here that the L2918 will power up. And also with this, the motor will start rotating. At first it is rotating clockwise, then after Two seconds it is rotating anti-clockwise after it again waiting for two seconds it is rotating clockwise at a slower speed and again anti-clockwise after two seconds at a slower speed and then it stops according to the code so guys thanks a lot for watching my video till the end if you like the video give a thumbs up and share this video with your friends and interested ones also do hit the subscribe and bell icon to get all latest notifications on robotics and electronics projects I'll be back soon on my next project tutorial, so till then, have a nice time.